think when we're recruiting for international roles here in in Manchester, obviously, the, obviously language uh, and business language, you know, and having that uh, that the fluency and that sort of business fluency is really really important. So by understanding how you know businesses work in that particular sector, um, and if you have any way of understanding how UK businesses work in that sector, it will give you a huge advantage. Um, but but you know having the fluency and the business understanding of the language is is, is really the first step. Um, and, um, and 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 but everyone's viewed on the same level. It's it's about hard work. It's about interest in the in the role. It's about the passion to develop uh, your career. And you know employers will soon realise that you know everyone is on a level playing field and give everyone the same chance to develop their careers uh, in their particular organisation. You will realise that you know different countries um, are at different levels in terms of how advanced they are with their their, their digital or their marketing techniques and ideas and and and, and you know by, by working certainly in a European uh, environment um, or uh, a UK market you you, you are reasonably advanced in comparison to some areas of the world. Um, particularly you know, in digital from a UK point of view and, and, and certainly across Europe, it's so much more advanced, for example, than Australia. So the demand for, for, for skilled employees and relatively um, low experience f uh, from Australian employees, uh, employers is quite high because they, they want to bring them over, they want to uh, have that experience in their marketplace. Um, but different Different countries have different restrictions and different legislation in terms of how um, you know, marketing works and the, the parameters that they're allowed to operate within. And, um, and, and, and so some countries would be more matched and suitable to um, you know, the UK or Europe um, than, than, than others would. Um, but I think it's um, the, generally the opportunity for uh, you know, being mobile and, and, and being able to move you know, internationally into different countries is, is, is great within this particular market. Um, I've got some experience working um, with eBay in Switzerland and um, over the years they've been very keen to attract um, skilled, well-educated um, uh, employees from UK and from France because they, 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 they call that brain drain and call upon that brain drain to, 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 to maximize the, 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 the skill set, the attitude, the aptitude and the, and the drive of employees within, within their business. So you'll find that, 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 that the corporates and, and companies across the world will be very keen to identify the best candidates and draw them to their organizations and you know, you know the, although there are language barriers and, um, and, and elements that exist, the, the, the more experience that you get within your particular role and the more that you look on a global scale, um, the more employable you'll be internationally. <laughs>